The annual Project Homeless Connect returns to serve the Las Vegas Valley's homeless and low-income populations in partnership with the Nevada Homeless Alliance. They will be joined by faculty and students from Toro University, Nevada. Yeah, and here with details, we have Dr. Rebecca Edgeworth, Assistant Professor of Toro's Physician Assistant Program, mm -hmm. and Katrina Grigsby, Executive Director of the Nevada Homeless Alliance. Welcome, ladies. Hi. Thank you. Yeah. Hi. We want to know more about what is going on and, and what people can expect all day. So, and I know you were saying this is the first time you're offering mammograms. Sure, we have lots of medical services, um, not just medical, but mammograms, uh, dental, vaccines, all different vaccines, lots of different things are being offered. Mm. Now, this is not the first year for this event. In fact, it's been serving the Valley for years. Both you ladies have been involved for several years as well. Tell us a little bit about the history of the event. So this is our 30th um, event. The uh, wow. Nevada Homeless Alliance was founded in 1992. And previously, this event was called the Homeless Stand Down. Uh, the name was changed in 2007 to Project Homeless Connect. So every year since we've existed, we've had an event to serve our low income and homeless populations. Mm -hmm. What well, I was gonna say, who can receive services? What do we need to know of what, how we qualify? Yes, so anyone can receive services. Um, we have a multiple range of services from housing assessments to jobs, um, community resources, um, medical um, services, as Dr. Edgeworth uh, mentioned. We have showers, clothing, and anything you can think of. Um, other services for youth, families, and veterans as well. That's right. wonderful. Dr. Edgeworth, uh, there are some really important opportunities for people who may not have access to these services regularly. Um, what do you feel uh, are the uh, most important things that people can do to come down and, and get their health checked? What is most relevant at this event for folks? So I would say that the most uh, important thing about what we do for this event is that we're offering same day services. Oh. So it isn't just people coming down and getting a pamphlet. They're getting help right then and there. Seeing practitioners right then and there, seeing dentists uh, getting services right there. And um, exactly as Katrina said, it's open to everybody. So it isn't just for homeless population. It's uh, for people who are at risk of homelessness or low income. It's mm -hmm. open to everybody. Yes. What is that day like for you? You've been doing it for a long time. Do, do people leave relieved, happy, uh, refreshed, and just, I, I can only imagine it's so rewarding. Yes, it's a very busy day for yeah. staff, of course, <laughs> but um, with the wi wide range of services that we offer, you know, we do a survey at the end and um, the majority of the individuals are stating that they receive services they would not have received if mm. they didn't attend the event. So yes, it's very rewarding. We're housing people same day. Some individuals may get employed the same day, get medical checkups, uh. um, multiple things. We make sure everyone is fed and we also have a clothing store where individuals can <laughs> shop for clothing and hygiene. Speaking of clothing, uh, you're reminding me about the ability for other folks to donate or yes. contribute. Uh, by the way, the event's tomorrow, 9 to 4. This, I imagine this is a day where, when it's over, you guys are going to be a little tired. <laughs> Sounds like there's going to be a lot going on. Dana and I yeah. know what those days are like. Yeah, absolutely. Um, but how can we contribute or, or be, be So individuals it? can bring donations directly to the event over mm -hmm. at the Silver Nugget at 2140 Las Vegas Boulevard. Um, just we're going to have a check-in booth and uh, the individual can stay there here to donate and we will take those donations and make sure the individuals that need the most um, receive them. That's great. Excellent. And year-round, how can we help? So you can go to our website at www.nevadahomelessalliance.org. We have um, opportunities to volunteer, to donate um, items mm -hmm. or, or money mm -hmm. and also you can see you know the, the other things that we do in the community and reach out to us with any questions our our main focus is partnership so we work with a lot of agencies in the community and we just want to make sure we know where the resources are so when we get inquiries we can point people in the right oh, direction it sounds like it's a great event for so many real quick before we go dr edgeworth uh, for the students these are medical mm -hmm. students correct that are right out at exactly the there are people who are really going valuable. to be practitioners mm -hmm. out in the community very soon and right. so it's this is a really good way to connect people connect yeah. students that's great Absolutely. good Excellent. for them Good. It's I love a valuable that. event on so many levels. It Thank is. you so much, guys. Thank you for Good luck us. <laughs> once again. Thank you. Thank you. Project Homeless Connect is at the Silver Nugget. It's tomorrow from 9 to 4 p.m. And for more info, you can visit the website for Toro, University of Nevada, and the Nevada Homeless Alliance. Thank you, guys.